Hello fellow Sudokans and welcome to Zen and the Art of the Guardian Sudoku Puzzle. It's Saturday the 20th of May 2023 and I hope you are keeping well. Saturday means expert level day in the Guardian, although whether or not it turns out to be one, I uh, we, we have no idea. Uh, I see rather a lot of digits on the grid. Um, counterintuitively, I suspect that might mean it's quite tough. Um, <laughs> I don't know why. I just think that it might mean there's going to be more of a logic puzzle. But uh, we have been disappointed before, so temper your excitement. Uh, it's always good when there is some uh, mirth in the news, some joviality, something more light-hearted. And uh, today's uh, bringer of fun is <laughs> Canadian Premier Justin Trudeau. Um, <laughs> have you seen the picture of him from Korea? <laughs> Trudeau, Trudeau impersonates James Brown. <laughs> you can just imagine he's going to do this. Do you remember James Brown doing the splits on stage? Well, if you haven't seen Justin Trudeau with his legs wide apart, <laughs> have a look in the newspaper. Well, what on earth was he thinking? It's like he was going to grab, <laughs> grab the Korean politicians by the hand and swing them under his legs or something. What on earth was he thinking? Very strange, but thank you for that. Uh, Mr. Trudeau. Right, we shall get on with the game of Sudoku, shall we? Because as I say, it might turn out to be a good one. And also, I'm going out. So, uh, one blocking up here. Let's start with the ones. I won't bother to explain the rules of Sudoku. You must know them if you are playing the expert level game, even if it turns out to be a less than expert um, puzzle. Um... Right, what are we missing down here? We're looking for uh, 278. Any help on that? We've got 2 and 7 over here. Okay. Ah, okay, so 8 is one of our missing digits here, right? And that blocks that square from becoming an 8. We have 8 blocking these two squares. So in this row, that's the only possible place where an 8 can live. So there you go. It lives there. Oh, and actually, 8's across this way. And down here means we can also place an 8 there now, doesn't it? I said that I thought that there were a lot of numbers on the screen, but actually I'm not sure that there were or 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 All right, let's uh, click on the digits and see if I spot anything new. Oh, yeah. Okay, we've got uh, one blocking these squares here and one blocking across here and across here. So in this column, the one must go there.
Um, in this row, I don't see a uh, 7. And 7 is one of our missing digits here. So 7 will block here and 7 will block here. So that's got to be a 7, hasn't it? Then we can take the 7 going up here like so. And that will place a 7 there. Ah, 7 blocks this square. We don't have 7 in this column yet, so let's place a 7. Let's finish off this column with... Uh, what are you? What are you? S uh, I can't find you. Th what? What's missing? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7... It's a 9. <laughs> Took me a long time to find. Um, meanwhile, we have nine down here, nine across here as well, so we'll place our nine there. Uh, and we've got nine and five across here and nine and five down here, so I've got a pair of nine and five here. I don't know if that means anything. Let's see if it does. Um, so nine and five, uh, what else do we know? One, two, three, six, seven in these squares, so seven down here. Um, it doesn't work much magic for me so we'll forget that for now uh, except of course uh, five is one of our missing digits here so in fact we've got the five blocking there <laughs> so I was thinking about something else but there we go found this instead and this will be a six is it okay last number to place down here is a four one number to place up here which is a seven I want to say seven across here and seven across here gives me a seven in that square if you can hear my stomach rumbling I do apologize I'm trying not to eat though because I'm going out for lunch and I expect to overeat as usual <laughs> so um, I'm, I'm not having breakfast this morning Um, what's missing up here? Uh, four, five, is it? Five, four, one thing over here. Uh, right. And go back to looking at these again. So we have. 1 and 2 across here and we have 1 and 2 up here so we get ourselves a pair of 1 and 2 in these squares here right now we know that that's 1 and 2 um, what else 3 6 7 8 oh. not a lot But now we've got two over here instead, so we'll place the two up there. Two down here, two down here, there's our two. And we know that two, I just said a moment ago, two, two is in these squares here, right? Two has to be here and here. So blocking down here, two across here and two down here so we can in fact get our two there now Okay, five up here puts five into this square or this square blocking down here. Five across here and five across here means we can get ourselves a five here. 
6 blocks this square here. We need a 6 in this column, so it must go there, and 4 will finish this column. Um, 1, 3, 8 here now. So this is a 3 blocking down here. It must be a 3 somewhere in here. So 3 blocks down there. That will be our 3. And then the 3... Oh, no, we don't need it. It's up there. Excuse me. I almost made a fool of myself. Uh, we've got um, 3 and 7 in these squares now. Right? 7, you can see, blocking across here. 3, you can see, blocking across here. So this is not 3 or 7. It must be a 6. And we will finish here with a 4, I think it is. Now, earlier on, I worked out what goes here. I've forgotten what that was now, is it? I'm fighting against the uh, background noise. This is 5 and 9, wasn't it? 5 and 9? Yes, 5 and 9. Okay, this is a pair of 5 and 9. And we know this was 7 and 3. So this is 6. Uh, 6 up here, 6 across here, and across here will give us a 6 in that square there. Okay, we have 7 blocking this square and 7 blocking this square, or just that 7 there by itself actually is good enough to give us a 7 there. And so 7 down here and across here means that's our 7. Now, uh, this was a 3, wasn't it, to finish here? 3 blocks up here, 3 across here, there's a 3. 3 to the top, up here like this, and 3 across here, there's a 3. The last number to place here, uh, I think it's an 8. I'm going to go with 8. Uh, eight blocks across here and across here, and eight is one of our missing digits here, so blocking up there, that's got to be an eight up there. We do not have any finished digits yet. Can you believe we've come this far in the grid and we still haven't got a completed digit? That's amazing. All right, let's see then. So we'll go through the whole lot and see if we can place any right now. Uh, can we get the ones finished? I don't think so like that. Can we get the twos finished? Uh, not quite. Can we get the threes finished? Well, how about this? Ta-da! There we go. Now we have a finished digit. Um, and we can come across here and place an eight, I guess it is. Uh, and now we have the eight blocking up here. So we will get ourselves an eight there and an eight across here. And we will have finished the eights. This then will become a one and one blocks across here and there's our digit one so now we've finished one three and eight things are looking up two is here two blocks across there giving us a deuce in that position there that's also finished now here we need a seven this did not turn out to be a, a tough logic game did it i thought it might there was a there was a chance but it didn't turn out to be like that and i'm using the past tense because i'm pretty sure from this stage on it's not going to give us any serious headaches he said <laughs> um, without certainty um five there we go six across there and six up there gives me a six in that square six back this way six up here there's a six we can place. Uh, a nine across here gives me a nine in that square. Nine across here and nine up here means that's our nine. We need another nine somewhere down here. Nine blocking down. There you go. And the missing digit here is going to be a five. I'm putting a five into that square there. We also have five blocking up here, meaning that's a five, five blocks across here, and here goes the final five. And we only need a four to finish today's so-called expert level game. Really wasn't up to that 
what the standard was it anyway that's it thank you and i'll see you another time for more sudoku bye bye